Everybody, welcome to Coronation Day 46. I am outside of the house getting a snow cone, but practicing safe social distancing. Andrew, what are you up to? Oh, I'm just here too. Uh -oh. we, we just ran into each other. <laughs> How crazy is that? Yeah, man. I, I should have missed you, Corey. I miss you too. I miss High five. Uh, yep. <laughs> Anyway, uh, today we're going to do some fun stuff. Yeah, we are. Even more fun than snow cones. Corey, I have the same shirt on I had yesterday. That's weird. That's uh, awkward. <laughs> <laughs> you should shower more often. Um, <laughs> Coronation. Yikes. Sorry, guys. Hey, look at this gigantic snow cone that Kelly's eating. Oh, my goodness. That's insane. All right, Andrew, tell him goodbye. See ya. Bye. Okay. How long have we been stirring to get that salt in there, y'all? A long time. About 30 minutes. Maybe not 30 minutes, but a really long time. So it does take a lot longer to stir the salt in. So Henry, hold up the insults. So the eggs, what do the eggs represent? Insultias. Insults. The eggs represent insults. Insults, like unkind words. So can y'all please hold up the eggs for me? We're making a video for kids at church so they can do this, okay? So. Those are insults. And we have two cups of water, one with salt. Salt represents the kindness and encouragement and one without. So Levi, I want you to put the first egg in the water without the kindness and encouragement, without the salt and see what happens. Y'all can pause the video and make guesses if you want. Put it in there, just very, no, 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 you can't crack it. It can't be cracked. It's gotta be, just drop it in. Oh, what happened? Let's get close. What happened, guys? Can y'all tell them? Henry, what did it do? It sunk. So if that was your heart, and you got a big old insult, what did the heart do when it's not encouraged or kind words or encouragement isn't helping it? It sank. It sinks, that's right. Okay, now, Henry is going to drop. Give it one last stir. You got that? It would take hours to stir this. Let's see what happens when you drop a big fat insult into the water full of kindness and encouragement. Guys, can you see this? What's it doing, Henry? Floating. It's floating. It's floating. So what can you learn from this, Henry? Uh, the, the salt makes things better. Like you need to keep people's hearts up. You don't want them, their hearts to sink because mm -hmm. like they're sad. That's right. That is so right. Okay, Levi, did you learn anything from this experiment? Uh, Why don't you go stand by the eggs so they can look at the eggs? See, one is sinking and one is floating. <laughs> what did you learn, Levi? Can I Tell us. After you tell me what you learned. That sounds like well, a great idea. I learned that if you have a fault, if you have a heart full of kindness, that if someone insults you, it, you will, you'll still be, will still be happy because if someone, because salt always makes things better. Mm -hmm. So what if you were the salt of the earth? That's what it says in the Bible. So if you were the salt, what is our job? If other people are the egg and you're the salt, what's the, what is your job? To help people sink or help people float? Help people float. Look at the camera and tell me. Float. Float, you wanna help people float, right? Okay, so Henry, can you sum up this experiment we did today? This was part of Henry's Bible study today. Why don't you sum it up? Yes. What did you learn? The, the eggs are like big, um, nasty comments or stuff like that. And the, um, so if you put it in here, it's like we're supposed to hold up the people's hearts. I love that. They're like sad or mad or angry. Did you hear that, guys? We're supposed to hold up people's hearts. That's exactly what God calls us to do. So if y'all want to do this at home, these are the things that you will need. You will need two cups, one with plain water, a third a cup, and one 
with water, a third a cup of water, but you're gonna add a third a cup of salt to it. And you're no. gonna and you're gonna stir it together. Oh, I'm sorry. It's a half a cup of water in each. They need to be warm water. You put a third a cup of salt in one of them. And then once the salt is dissolved, you can drop an egg in both. And you can see that the big fat insults, one of them sinks in the water without kindness and encouragement. And the other one floats. Can y'all say goodbye? Signing off from the Dickerson house. We're signing off. All right, boys and girls, it is time for another game. Now, today's game, Andrew, you could play along and stuff, but I want to see if your boys can destroy all of the people watching at home. All Soul Hills kids, everybody, good luck. It's called Zoomed In Quarantine Edition. I'm gonna show you some videos and it's going to be something zoomed way in. Like it's gonna be a picture that you look really, really close to and you're gonna have to guess what it is that you're looking at and see who can guess first. Who can be the fastest at guessing what it is? Now, this is Quarantine Edition and so I've made some videos with game with like activities different things that you could be doing during this time and that'll be good hints for you and my suggestion is that you start guessing right away and so if it's zoomed real close you, you won't be able to tell but you could start guessing maybe it's a squirrel or maybe it's a dog or maybe it's a horse what do those have to do with quarantine i don't know but you're going to guess real quick with these videos and those of you playing at home, let's see if you can beat the Brooks boys. Good luck, here we go. Here we go, okay. Zoom Zoomed in. in. Oh, what do you think? Y'all can make a different guesses. What is it? Guess, Cake. guess. Cake. Pizza. Pizza. Pancake, that's what Pancake. Okay, I got y'all right. I, I got it right. I got it right. Mm-hmm. Here we go. All right, y'all have to guess. Y'all are trying to beat each other, okay? Okay. Ready? Here we go. What's the next one? What is it? Make a guess. Um, colors. Colors. Okay. Colors. Colors. But it's more than just colors. A swan. 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 Origami swan. Yep. Boom. Origami crane. Okay. Same thing. Okay. It's Same more than thing. colors. It's something. It's going to be something that you know. Okay? Pancake? No. Uh-uh. Arm. Eyes. It's a face. Face. Of. Book. Somebody reading. Yeah. I said face. Eyes. Reading a book. Okay, ready? This is hard. What's the next one? Okay. Zoomed in. Okay, what is it? Um, let's see. What is that? Antenna a Switch. Rubik's Cube. Rubik's Cube. Yeah, it's a Rubik's Cube. Boom! You said Nintendo Switch? No, he said Somebody Nintendo. said Nintendo Switch? Rubik's Cube. Okay. I'm not doing good, guys. It's okay. Chronication's probably gonna help us out. Zoomed in. Oh. What is that? A camera. camera. A camera? Um. No. 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 What is it? What A is it? Oh! Oh! Connect 4! Connect 4. Yes! I think you were thinking it. You just couldn't yeah, get it out. I just couldn't get it out. Let's see. What's next? Zoom. What is this? What is this? Oh. Puffs! Crayons! I said it. Man, that one took me a while. Crayons! You guys are wrong. Man, guys, we are, we're not getting these very fast. I know. Let's see here. Um, what is it? There's something red in there. What is that? Piano! Oh, y'all beat me! You beat me to a piano! <laughs> nice job, guys. Piano. All right. Piano. Something. Let's see, what's next? Zoomed in. Oh, 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 oh! Oh, golf stick. What is uh, 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 what? A puzzle. Oh, you know, I thought that was a guitar at first because of the hole, but I think that you were right. It's puzzle pieces. Nice job. Boys, that's two in a row y'all beat me on.
That's it. That's it. There's not another one. How did you guys do? Uh, because bad. we struggled a little bit on they the front did end. Bad. But they then y'all, man, y'all started kicking butt there. <laughs> yeah, that was good. All right, guys. We will see you tomorrow. tomorrow.